This is Tyrannosaurus rex, the tyrant lizard king. 40 feet long, over nine tons, truly a superlative predator, one of the largest carnivores ever to walk the earth. But where did it come from? And paleontologists have been wondering about the origins of Tyrannosaurus rex ever since they found it over a century ago. Well, the answer doesn't lie in Montana or Wyoming or the typical places where T-Rex is found, but in southern Utah in 80 million year old rocks that are now yielding the beginnings of the T-Rex story. So the Tyrannosaurus I grew up with were really reptilian, scaly, scabrous, really menacing sorts of reptiles. But Lithronax here has got proto feathers, and that's something that you know, a lot of people ask about. Were Tyrannosaurus really fluffy and fuzzy? Well, even though we haven't found direct evidence of proto feathers on Lithronax, other Tyrannosaurus, primarily found in China, have been found with these very filament, downy-like body coverings. There's a small one called DeLong that was only about six feet long, this little raptor-like Tyrannosaur, but a larger one, much like Lithronax here, that was 30 feet long, called uh, Euteranus, was totally covered in these early sorts of feathers. So in general, Tyrannosaurs were a fluffy, fuzzy, predatory family. 